Yoga Nidra is a form of Tantra. It is not sleeping. It is not concentration. It is opening the inner chambers of your mind. In Yoga Nidra, you step down into the internal dimension of your consciousness. Even if you do not understand anything in Yoga Nidra, it does not matter. The sound of my voice acts as a rope. Just as you take a rope and go in and out of the depths of the cave, so with the help of the sound, you will venture in and out of the mind. Prepare for yoga nidra. The eyes are closed and the body is still, the mind. The mind is in the mood to relax. You are not trying to concentrate. Make no effort to control the mind. You are practicing yoga nidra. Become aware of the whole body. You are lying in a beautiful room. There are other bodies out there practicing yoga nidra on the same mental level. Almost everybody is emanating the same frequency of vibration. The whole atmosphere is charged with one type of powerful vibration. In this atmosphere, you are lying on your mat, your body, your body is still. The sound of your breath is very rhythmic, very rhythmic and slow. Your body is in a state of relaxation. Now think mentally, I am going to practice yoga nidra. I am listening to the instructions. A constant communication is taking place between the instructor and myself. I can hear the sound of her voice and we are connected. One transmitter, many, many receivers. At this point, I ask you to create what we call a sankalpa. This is your dedication, your resolution. Call it to mind and state it firmly, state it with resolve three times. Keep listening to my voice and go on doing the practices that I indicate. No concentration, please. Do not try to analyze things. Become aware, become aware of your right hand thumb and mentally say right hand thumb, no movement. Right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, top of the foot, sole of the foot, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Now go to the left side. Become aware of the left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, Fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, 
lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, thigh, knee, calf muscle, ankle, heel, top of the foot, sole of the foot, left big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Next, next, go to the back of the body, the back of the head, back of the neck, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, right buttock, left buttock, right heel, left heel. Now, the front of the body, top of the head, forehead, right temple, left temple, right ear, left ear, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, middle of the eyebrow, right eye, left eye, right nostril, left nostril, whole nose, right cheek, left cheek, upper lip, lower lip, both lips together, chin, neck, right collarbone, left collarbone, right side of the chest, left side of the chest, middle of the chest, navel, upper abdomen, lower abdomen, right leg, left leg, right arm, left arm, the whole of the head, the whole body, the whole body, the whole body. Become aware of the body lying on the floor. There is a point where the body is in contact with the floor. Bring your awareness to that particular point of contact the heels and the floor. Both the heels are on the floor. And there is a point where they touch the floor. Now from the top of the body, the head and the floor, the back and the floor, the right hand and the floor, the left hand and the floor, the right elbow and the floor, the left elbow and the floor, the buttocks and the floor, the hamstring and the floor, the heels and the floor. Imagine the meeting points of the body and the floor, the whole body and the floor, the body is on the floor. Become aware of the whole body. Do not contract and do not expand the whole body. Just imagine in your mind that the body is becoming very heavy. Awaken the idea of heaviness in the body. Gradually feel that the body is becoming heavier and heavier. The head is becoming heavy. The right palm is heavy. 
the left palm is heavy. Both arms and the shoulders are heavy. The back is heavy. The buttocks and the groin are heavy. The right thigh is heavy. The left thigh is heavy. Both the kneecaps are heavy. Both legs are heavy. Both arms are heavy. The whole head is heavy. The eyes are heavy. The lips heavy. The whole body is heavy. Keep thinking that the whole body is heavy. The feeling of heaviness, it intensifies. And gradually just relax part by part. Now, now feel the whole body becoming lighter and lighter. The head is light, so light that it can even rise from the floor. The right and left palms are becoming lighter. Both arms and both shoulders are light. The back is light, the buttocks and the groin are light. The right thigh is light, the left thigh is light. The right heel and the left heel are light. The whole body is light, light and weightless. When your body becomes weightless, you feel as if it is rising from the floor, as if the whole body is a mass of cotton. Cotton represents lightness and steel represents heaviness. Now practice these two experiences alternately. The whole body is steel. The whole body is steel. There are no bones, marrow, or blood, just a steel frame. Change this idea. The whole body is cotton. The whole body is as light as cotton. There are no bones, marrow, or blood. Everything is composed of cotton. The whole body is as light as cotton. Again, we change. The whole body is like steel, heavy steel, no bone, no marrow, marrow or blood. The whole body is heavy as steel. Change this idea, the whole body is light as cotton. Feel as if the body was composed of cotton, cotton so light it can rise up from the floor. Now change the idea to heat. Imagine you are near a burning furnace and you feel intense heat. Now the whole body should experience the heat of a blazing furnace of the hot tropical sun, awaken the experience of heat as vividly as you can. We change the experience. The whole body is experienced. The cold winds that blow from the snowy mountains, the same cold one feels in a deep freezer. The experience of cold, awaken the experience of cold. Bring your mind to the eyebrow center. Do not leave that point until I tell you. I will enumerate a few objects. And as I name each one, try to visualize it very quickly. If you cannot, there is no worry. Keep on following my instructions. Sometimes I will go slow and others very fast. I will also come back to the image a number of times. Some of the images may be known to you, but do not think too much. The image should simply shine on its own. The awareness is to the eyebrow center. Darkness. Pink rose. 
waves of the ocean, blue sky in the evening, dark night, tiny shining stars studded in the heaven, high mountain ranges with snow-capped peaks, a ship sailing on the high seas, white sandy beach. Virgin forest with tall and dense trees, a dove, a galloping horse, a small hut in the woods, burning fire in the bush, stormy night, full moon, mountain stream, a lonely rock in the mountains, a lush garden filled with blooming flowers, the rising sun. The awareness still remains at the eyebrow center. Visualize a large lake with a lotus flower, a sailing boat, people swimming, a lonely wooden hut in the mountains, a desolate valley, a high mountain with snow-capped peaks, a quiet evening, beautiful sunset, chirping birds, tiger in the forest, elephant, cobra, the symbol of Om, sound of a bell ringing, waves on the ocean, ship at sail, the full moon, Calm and quiet evening in the moonlit valley. Mountain stream, refreshing cold bath in the mountain stream. Experience the exhilaration. Now I invite you to become aware of your breath. Inhale through the left nostril and exhale through the right. Start to practice mental alternate nostril breathing. Inhale through the left nostril and exhale through the right. Inhale through the left nostril, exhale through the right. The awareness shifts to the middle of your brow once again. See the rising sun, red like a tomato, clouds gathering in the sky, drizzling rain, fog all around, pink rose, sunflower, apple, lettuce leaf, hot water spring, tall pine tree, cluster of grapes, Symbol of Om, lonely wooden hut in the valley, snow-capped peaks, mountain stream, cool bath, ship sail on the sea, lotus on the lake, people swimming. Now, I ask you to develop awareness of the chakras, and their positions in the spine. Muladhara chakra at the perineum, in between the urinary and excretory organs. The woman, it is at the base of the uterus. Awareness at the muladhara. Don't contract this point, but try to feel spontaneous contractions there. Imagine contractions but don't contract, contractions at the muladhara. Next, at the base of the spine is the swadhisthana, and the vertebral column behind the navel is the manipura. Behind the heart is the anahata, the throat is the vishuddhi. At the top of the vertebral column is the agnya. At the top back of the head is bindu, and the crown of the head is Saraharashtra. Try to remember the location of the chakras. 
Repeat the names mentally after me and mentally touch your spine very rapidly at the correct point, even if you cannot feel this. This does not matter. Repeat the name mentally after I say Muladhara, Swadhisthana, Manipura, Anahata, Vishuddhi, Agnya, Bindu, Sarhara, Bindu, Agnya, Vishuddhi, Anahata, Manipura, Swani, Stana, Muladhara, Swadhisthana, Manipura, Anahata, Vishuddhi, Agnya, Bindu, Sarasrara, Bindu, Agnya, Vishuddhi, Anahata, Manipura, Swadhisthana, Muladhara, I ask you now to become aware of the whole body. Think mentally, I am practicing yoga nidra. Visualize your whole body and every body in this room. Become aware of the external environment. Become aware of yourself. Say to yourself, I am practicing yoga nidra. Everyone around me is practicing yoga nidra. I am visualizing my body and everybody practicing yoga nidra. Call to mind your sankalpa. Again, state it three times with resolve. Slowly, when you are ready, begin to become aware the outside world, your external environment. It is time to come out of the spirit of yoga nidra and return to normal awareness. Allow the eyes to open. Allow the hands to come together at the Anahata Chakra. In this mudra of gratitude and balance, please know I am so grateful for you coming out and sharing this beautiful practice of yoga nidra with me. It has been an honor, a pleasure, and a pure privilege. End our time together with the sound of Om. Inhale. Om. May the entire universe be filled with peace and joy, love and light. Jai Shri Sadhguru Maharaj came in the light of truth of the Tamil darkness. Namaste. Hari Om Tat Sat.